I locked my arm in the pantry when I was three and she was in there four hours until Grandma turned up a tea tank to lift the latch and find poor mom crouched in a pool of tears, face as red as my backside would be when Dad got home. That's my earliest memory. Next up, swallowing stones in the schoolyard the following spring because Simon Wilson dared me to. We slept through story time and got smacked. Mrs Smith said we were lazy. On my fifth birthday, I got a little milk float with individual crates stacked on the back and you could take the bottles out as well. Dad brought it back from Grandma's after a bike race so it must have been a Sunday and he was in a good mood so he must have won. Always talking about gears and crank sets and training. And I'd never even ridden a tricycle. Scott Jones lived over the road. He could be as nice as ninepence one minute, then turn into a right little swine just for the hell of it. One day, his dad caught me with a share of a dip dab that didn't belong to me, started talking about right and wrong and Jesus and all that. Lucky he didn't come knocking at our door, or that would have been another rollicking.